Live from NBC4, this is the Channel 4 News at 5. I'm Dr. Bruce Hensel. If your child's head, if your baby's head seems out of shape, it may be because of something that you're doing, but there is a simple way to cure it. We'll tell you all about it coming up. A nationwide campaign to prevent sudden infant death syndrome urged parents to place their babies on their back to sleep. Well, that was successful, but it also had unintended consequences. Flat head syndrome, which can lead to other health problems as well. Our own Dr. Bruce Hensel is here now to tell us about a simple solution that can help. Dr. Bruce. Well, it turns out, Chuck, and this was life-saving in many cases, but the paradox is it caused this problem. I've been told by specialists nearly one out of every 10 baby has got this misshapen head. That's because as a child's heads, heads grow, the bones grow together. That caused the problem, but it also can lead to a solution. So we visited a cranial tech clinic in Orange County that is offering this solution. Cadence Hirschman is a bundle of joy, but early on, her parents noticed something was not quite right. Her head every week was becoming more and more misshaped. We didn't know if she was going to be, her head was going to be misshaped forever. The symmetry you know, in her face was changing very fast. Her cheekbones and her jawline was flattening. This eye was getting smaller. This ear was coming forward. Cadence has flat head syndrome. Plagiocephaly, it's called. The numbers have shot up because parents are placing babies on their back when they sleep to reduce the risk of SIDS. As a result, babies spend a significant more amount of time on their backs, which is causing this flat head shape. If the problem gets worse and goes untreated, it could lead to other problems. Not just hats and glasses not fitting. Jawline issues such as TMJ or underbite, um, eye and ear misalignment. The good news is it can be fixed. This clinic addresses the problem through infant helmets that mold the baby's head, called dock bands. First, they take a photo of the baby's head using 15 digital cameras. Then, a 3D image is sent to a lab where they custom make a dock band for the baby's head to make it round. The dock band is adjusted and shaved back as the baby's head grows. We're encouraging growth into the flattened areas and we're also adjusting the band throughout the process, giving more room where they need to grow. These photos show the difference before treatment and after treatment. Cadence has been in therapy for six weeks. Her parents say they can see a difference. We saw like a complete round head and we're just like almost in tears. Oh, so happy. Treatments normally take about 10 weeks, and that beca that's because the bones are growing back together. Not every baby who has a flat head needs a dock band. All babies' heads are soft. Many of them wind up growing into a normal shape on their own, but some need more help. If you notice something in your kid you're worried about, talk to your doctor about what's right for your baby. For more information on this, go to our website, NBCLA.com. Keyword, baby heads. Back to you. All right, Dr. Bruce, that is amazing. Yeah. You really see such I mean, a significant change. Ten weeks there. doesn't seem like a terribly long time for that. No, not at yeah. all.